Dr. Cameron Richards, a forensic entomology student at Rhodes University, is your real-life CSI kind of guy. He's off to investigate a dead horse found by a farmer. The process of forensic investigations is basically going out into the field and collecting maggot specimens, um, bringing them back to the lab, and basically really just determining how old they are, and then from that we can work out um, when that person died. At the moment, we conduct um, several investigations with the police in the Grahamstown community and also in, in other communities, like such as Petty, King Williamstown, we, we get cases from that far out. In, in our lab, there's a lot of, it's not so nice to say, but there's a lot of work. I care for many reasons about researching in forensic entomology because it's so young, so there's just so much to do. So basically anything you do is, uh, is new and novel. In these three cages behind me, we keep the flies that we work with. In, in each cage is a different species, um, and they lay their eggs on the, on the rotting meat, and the larvae grow up. We take the larvae from, from the cages and then put them in the incubators where we work with them further. You wouldn't say a saxophone, martial arts and painting models have much in common, but Cameron lives his life outside the labs in a number of creative ways. However, his passion is really his work. I'm just so incredibly passionate about this research, just on the basic science level. It's just, I think it's just such a fascinating, fascinating topic.